Lionhead Rabbit, all you need to know. Hello and welcome back to our channel. We're happy to have you here. Lionhead rabbits are real head turners and they're also very affectionate with their owner. This is making them increasingly one of the most popular breeds in the US, especially with suburban environments. And in this video, we'll get you up to speed on all you need to know about the Lionhead Rabbit. History. While it is not clear, the Lionhead is thought to have originated in Belgium by breeders who tried crossing of the Swiss Fox with the Netherland Dwarf Rabbit in the 60s. And by the 90s, Lionhead Rabbits had become very popular and started getting exported to the United States. Despite their immense popularity among pet owners and show breeders, the Lionhead Rabbit has not only been recognized by the American Rabbit Breeders Association as early as 2014. Appearance Lionhead rabbits usually weigh up to 4 pounds and are considered a miniature rabbit because of their compact size. The genetic mutation that causes the growth of a woolly mane around the head, neck, and skirt of the lion rabbit is known as the mane gene. Lionheads only have two mane genes in them and they are referred to as double manes and those with only one mane are called single manes. There are lionheads born without a mane gene and they're called no mane. Once fully grown, double manes have thick fur around their head, cheeks, and skirts. Single manes, on the other hand, have a thinner fur around these features, and no manes don't develop the distinctive fur that characterizes the lion head rabbit. If two double manes mate, the baby rabbit is also always born a double mane, hence double manes are more preferred among professional breeders than other types. The only way to identify whether a baby rabbit is a double mane is to look for the V-shaped pattern of fur formed at the rabbit's lower back just after birth. Lion heads come in a variety of colors. Most popular are the ruby wide eye and the chestnut a goat. Temperament. Lion heads have an affectionate temperament and they're also very energetic. This makes them one of the best playmates you can have. Like all rabbits, lion heads take some time feeling safe and bond with their owners. But once they start to trust you, they love being around you and follow you everywhere you go. Nevertheless, lion heads are still rabbits and they may lose their trust if you don't respect their space or desire not to be cuddled. If you like these kinds of practical videos that get right to the point and you want to keep learning more interesting rabbit facts then be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button to let us know you appreciate our hard work. Thanks. Trainability. It is not difficult to train a lion head to use the litter box regularly. You can also train them to come to you when they're called their name and do some tricks for treats. Feeding. Hay should form around 70% of the rabbit's diet, and the rest should be a mix of leafy vegetables and high-nutrition food pellets. Always make sure your lion head gets a supply of fresh drinking water. You may want to check out our video on 6 foods that will kill your rabbit. The link is in the description below. Breeding As with most bunnies, it is best that the lion heads breed once they are 6 months old and sterilize them by the age of 2. Playtime. Since lion heads have energetic personalities, they need at least three hours of open playtime every day. It will be even better if you're able to play with your lion head every day as they simply relish having playtimes with their owner. Cage size. The cage size is 2.5 squared feet preferred for each individual lion head rabbit. A bigger cage is always welcome, and if you are down on space, you can also look for cages with more than one deck in order to utilize more of the vertical space. Always make sure the cage doesn't have a wire floor as they're very bad for your rabbit's feet and will cause sore hawks. Health. The lifespan of the lionhead rabbit is between 7 to 12 years old. While there are no health issues that are particular to the lionhead breed, they do need to be carefully monitored for common ailments without affect miniature rabbits. This includes meloculation, which refers to the misalignment of the top and bottom teeth causing the teeth to remain untrimmed. And since lion heads have thick fur, they need to be groomed at least once a week and more frequently during the shedding season when it usually comes during spring. You also need to make sure that their fur is always clean and dry as dirty and damp fur can cause a nasty fly strike. Periodic checkups at the vet are advisable to detect any anomalies and get the treatment started as early as possible. For more information, check out our video on the best rabbit brush. The link is in the description below. Suitable for the lion heads are suitable for most households and even apartments because of their small size and friendly character. Despite being highly energetic, lion heads are safe for children as they don't mind being cuddled and pet as long as you are train your children how to handle them. That's all for now. Please use the comment section below and share with us the experiences you've had with the adorable lion head rabbits. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.